The Kony Cable Systems FBC002 cleaver is a handheld cleaver designed to work with 250 micron, 900 micron, and even furricated fibers. It's a score and snap type cleaver. Basically, there's a clamp that holds the fiber, there's a blade to score the fiber, and the tool flexes to break the fiber. As always, before working with fiber, make sure that you have some safety glasses. And also, to dispose the fiber, a loop of tape is recommended. Also, be sure not to drop the fiber on sitting areas. Uh, exercise good housekeeping to avoid injury. I'm going to start with a 250 micron coated fiber. Remove at least 40 millimeters or 1.5 inches of coating from the fiber. Clean the fiber with at least 90% pure alcohol. And then insert the fiber into the tool. Depress the clamp handle to raise the clamp. Insert the fiber and make sure that the fiber coating butts up against the positive stop and then lower the clamp. The positive stop is this curved portion here and the distance between that point and the blade that scores the fiber gives the cleave length required for Unicam installation. Lower the cleaver arm to score the fiber and then flex the tool to break the fiber. Your fiber is now cleaved and ready for field connector termination. To remove the fiber waste, depress the clamp handle, grab the fiber with either a pair of tweezers or with your fingers and place it on a loop or tape. Prepare the 900 micron fiber and insert it into the tool in much the same way. When working with fan out kits, make sure that there is a four millimeter protrusion of the 250 micron coated fiber beyond the 900 micron tubing. When placing it into the tool, make sure that the coating on the 250 micron butts up against the positive stop and not the 900 micron. For camp splice installation, make sure that the fiber coating lines up with the 14 millimeter mark. Clean the tool after use. Make sure that there are no broken pieces of fiber that may interfere with the cleaver operation later. And periodically clean the tool with a wipe soaked in alcohol. Clean the blade and the clamp. A piece of card soaked in alcohol works great for cleaning the clamp. After cleaning with alcohol, finish the job with compressed air, and that's it.